The President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria is the head of state and the head of government of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The President directs the executive branch of the federal government and is the commander-in-chief of the Nigerian Armed Forces. The offices, the powers and titles of the head of state and the head of the government were officially merged into the office of the president, president's under 1979 Constitution of Nigeria. Executive power is vested in the president. The power includes the executive execution and enforcement of federal law and the responsibility to appoint federal executive diplomatic, regulatory, and judicial of officers. Based on constitutional provisions empowering the president to appoint and receive ambassadors and conclude treaties with foreign powers and on subsequent laws enacted by the House, the presidency has primary responsibility for the conducting foreign policy. President also plays a leading role in federal registration and domestic policy making as part of system of checks and balances. The constitution gives the president the power to sign or veto federal registrations. President is the direct is directly elected in national elections to a four-year term along with the vice president. Muhammadu Buhari is the 15th and current president of Nigeria, having assumed office on 29 May 2015 following the 2023 Nigeria presidential elections. Bora Tinubu is scheduled to succeed Buhari as president on 29 May 2023. On 1 October 1960, Nigeria gained independence from Britain. An old Nigerian executive council was headed by the a prime minister, Alihaj Sa Abubakar Tafawa Balewa. On 16 November 1960, Namud Azikiwe became the first governor general of a federal of three regions of the north, east, and west with Lagos as the federal capital. Each of the regions was headed by a premier with a governor as ceremonial head. The governors and the governors general represented the Queen of Nigeria, Elizabeth II. On 1st October 1963, Nigeria became a federal republic, thereby abolishing its monarchy, by, but remained a member of the Commonwealth of Nations. An amendment to the 1960 independence constitution replaced the office of Governor General with that of the President, Namud Azikwe was sworn into the office on 1st October 1963. The office at that time was primarily ceremonial and the main duties of president were on such things as receiving foreign dignitary, dignitaries and open, opening parliament. In a January 1966 fairy the coup d'etat, a group of army officers led by Major Chukuma Zeong overthrew the central and regional governments, killed the Prime Minister Abubakar Tafawa Barewa and tried to take control of the government. Zeong was countered, captured, and imprisoned by General Johnson Awi Ilonzi. General Awi Ilonzi was named head, military head of state. He, in July 1966, a group of North Amer officers revolted against the government, killed General Johnson Agui Ilonsi, and appointed the Army Chief of Staff General Yakubu Gowen as the head of the new military government. In 1975, General Yakubu Gowen was deposed. 
was deposed and General Mutara Muhammad was the head of the federal military government of Nigeria until his assassination in 1976. On his death, the chief of staff supreme headquarters, equivalent to the a vice president, General Orsegun Obasanjo, assumed the office of head of state in a meeting of the Supreme Military Council, keeping the chain of command established by Mutari Muhammad in the press. General Obasanjo was responsible for completing the democratic transition begun by his predecessor, which culminated in an election in August 1979. In 1979, Nigeria adopted a federal presidential constitution. The presidency became executive post with powers similar to those of its American counterpart. The legislature was a bicameral national assembly comprising a Senate and House of Representatives. In October 1979, after more than 13 years of military rules, Nigeria returned to democratic rule the National Party of Nigeria merged victorious in the presidential election and Shehu Shagari became the first democratic elected president. On 31 December 1983, the military overthrew the Second Republic. Major General Muhammadu Buhari emerged as the chairman of the Supreme Military Council, CMC, the new head of state. In August 1985, General Buhari's government was peacefully overthrown by the Army Chief of Staff General Major General Ibrahim Babangida. Babangida became the President and Chairman of the Armed Forces Ruling Council. In August 1993, General Babangida stepped down and chose an interim government to replace him. Ernest Shonekan was named as interim president. General Sani Abacha seized power from Shoneka in November. In November 1993, and became the president and chairman of the Provisional Ruling Council. On 8 June 1998, General Abacha died at the presidential villa in the Nigeria capital, Abuja. Major General Abu Saman Abu Bakar became the new president and chairman of the Provisional Ruling Council. On 29 May 1999, Major General Abdul Salam Abu Bakar stepped down, and the former military head of state, Orsegun Obasanjo, became the civilian president. Obasanjo served the two terms in office. In May 2007, Umaru Yaradwa was sold in as president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, the 13th head of state of Nigeria. Yaradua died on 5th May 2010 in a presidential villa in Abuja, Nigeria. On 6th May 2010, Vice President Goodluck Jonathan was sold in as the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the 14th Head of State. On 29th May 2015, Muhammadu Buhari was sold in as the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the 15th head of state after winning the general elections. Electoral system. The president of Nigeria is elected using a modified two-round system with up to three rounds. To be elected in the first round, a candidate must receive a popularity of the votes as well as over 25% of votes in it, at least 24 of 36 states and the federal capital territory. If no candidate passed this threshold, a second round will be held between the top candidate and the next candidate to have received a majority of votes in the high number of states. In the second round, the candidate still must receive the most votes as well as over 25% of the votes in at least 24 of the 36 states and the federal capital territory in order to be elected. If Neither candidate passed this threshold, a third round will be held, where a simple majority of votes is required to be erected. Presidential candidates run for the office with a, run, a running mate, their party's candidate for vice president. Eligibility 
chapter 6, part 1, section 131 of Constitution states that a person may be qualified for election of the office of the president if they are citizen of Nigeria by birth, they, are at, they have attained the age of 35 years from all 40 before 2018. They are... Um, a member of political party and are sponsored by that political party. They have been educated up to at least school certificate level or its equivalent. A person who meets the above qualifications is still disqualified from holding the office of the president if they have voluntarily acquired the citizenship of a country other than Nigeria except in such a case as may be described by the National Assembly or they have made a declaration of agreeance to such a other country. They have been elected to such office at any two previous elections. Under the law in any part of Nigeria, they are adjudged to be a lunatic or otherwise declared to be of unsound mind. They are under a sentence of death imposed by any competent, competent court of law or tribunal in Nigeria or a sentence of imprisonment or fine for any offense involving dishonesty and fraud or fraud or for any other offense imposed on them by any court or tribunal or subsistent, substituted by a competent authority for any other sentence imposed on them by a such a court or tribunal within a period of less than 10 years before the date of the election to be to the office of president they have been convinced convicted and sentenced for an offense involving dishonesty or they have been found guilty of the contravention of the code of conduct they are uncharged bankrupt have been adjudged or otherwise declared bankrupt under any law in force in nigeria or any other country being a person employed in the civil or public servant of the federal federation or of any state they have not resigned withdraw or retired from the employment at least 30 days before the date of the election. They are a member of any security society. They have been inducted, indicted for embezzlement or fraud by a judicial commission or of inquiry or an administrative panel of inquiry or a tribunal set up under the Tribunals of Inquiry Act. At tribunals of inquiry, law, or any other law by federal or state government which indictment have been accepted by federal or state government responsibly. They have presented a forged certificate to the Independent National Electoral Commission. The oath of office. The Constitution of Nigeria specifies an oath of office for the President of the Federation. The oath is administered by the Chief Justice of the Supreme Court of Nigeria or the person for the time being appointed to exercise the function of that office. I do summonly swear, affirm that I will be faithful and bear true agreements to the Federal Republic of Nigeria that as president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, I will discharge my duties to the best of my ability, face free and in accordance with the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the law, and always in the interest of sovereignty, integrity, solidarity, well-being and prosperity of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, that I will strive to preserve the fundamental objectives and the directives principle, directive principles of the 
state policy contained in the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria that I will not allow my personal interest to influence my official conduct or my official decisions, that I will, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, that I will abide by the codes of conduct contained in the fifth schedule of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, that in all circumstances, I will do the light, I will do right to all manner of the people according to law, without fear or favor, affection, or in will, or ill will, that I will not directly or indirectly communicate or defer it to any person any matter which shall be brought under my consideration or shall become known to me as president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, except as may be required for the due discharge of my duty as president, and that I will devote myself to serve and well-being of the people of Nigeria. So help me God. Republic since 1963 to present, First Republic 1963 to 1966. Under the 1963 constitution, the first constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Nigeria ran the parliamentary system of the government with a prime minister and the president replacing the monarchy as ceremonial head of state. The prime minister was formed by the head of the party that won the election, the first federal election was won by the Northern People's Congress, led by Abu Bakar Tafawa Barewa. The president was elected by the parliament for a five year term. In the event of a vacancy, the president of the Senate would have served as acting president. The first president, Dr. Namd Azikiwe, born in 19. 19- 04 died in 1996, took office 1st October 1963, and left office, office 16th January 1966, served two years and 107 days. His prime minister was Abubakar Tafawa Barewa. The second military government from 1966 to 1979. Major Chukuma Kaduna orchestrated the brother military coup d'etat of 1966, which overthrew the First Republic. The second, Major General Johnson Agui Ilonsi, born 1927, died 1966, took office 16 January 1966 and assassinated on 29 July 1966 in office 194 days. Number three, General Yakubu Gowen, born in 1934, took office 1st August 1966, left office 29 July 1975, deposed, served eight years and sat 365 days, 62 days. General Motari Muhammad, number four, born 1938, died 1976, took office 29 July 1975, assassinated 13 February 1976, served only 199 days. President number five, General Orsegun Obasanjo, born 1937, served from 13 February 1976 to 1 October 1979, designed. The first term there was three years and 230 days. He is the one who ended the First Republic, the Second Republic, or who ended the military government. Second Republic 1979 to 1983. 
Under the 1979 constitution, the second constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, the president was both head of state and the government. The president was elected by a four-year term in an event of a vacancy. The vice president would have served as acting president. Number six, Arihaj Shehu Shagari, born in 1925, died 2018, took office 1st October 1979, left office 1st December 1983, deposit, served 4 years and 91 days. Military government again from 1983 to 1993, Major General Muhammadu Bari was military head of state following the of 1980, which overthrew the Second Republic. Number seven, General Muhammadu Buhari, born in 1942, took office 31st December 1983 and left office 27th August 1985, deposed, served one year and 239 days. Number eight, General Ibrahim Bobangida, born in 1941 took office 27th August 1985 and left office 26th August 1993, resigned, served seven years, 264 days. Interim president or interim national government 1993, Chief Ernest Shonekani was made Interim head of state of Nigeria following the crisis of the Saudi Republic. Number nine, Chief Ernest Shonekan, born 1936, died 2022, took office 29th August 1993, left office 17th November 1993, deposed, took office only 83 days. Military government 1993 to 1999. General Sani Abacharedi, the Paris Coup d'etat of 1993, which overthrew the interim national government. Number 10, General Sani Abacha, born 1943, died in 1998. Took office 17 November 1993. Left office 8th June. 1998, died in the office and spent there four years, 203 days. 11th President General Abu Abdar Samar Salam Abu Bakar, born 1942, took office 9th June 1998 and resigned from office on 29th May 1999. Spent there 354 days. The First Republic from 1999 to present. Under the First Constitution of the Republic of Nigeria, the President is head of both state and government. The President is elected by the by for a four-year term in the event of vacancy for the Vice President serves as the acting president. 12. Chief Orsegun Obasanjo, born 1937, took office 29th May 1999, left office 29th May 2007, eight years. 2013. Arihaj Umaru Musa Yaradoa, born 1951. 2010, took office 20, 29 May 2007 and died in office on 5th May 2010, served 2 years, 341 days. 14. Dr. Goodluck Jonathan, born 1957, took office from 5th May 2010 to 29th May 2015, 5 years and 24 days.
15th president Muhammadu Buhari born in 1942 took office 29 May 2015 and will leave office 29 May 2023 where he will serve a total of 8 years 16th president chief bora Tinubu born 1952 and will take office 29th May 2023 designated remaining for 74 days to become president Tinubu Bola of the 13 presidents Only two or Seguni Obasanjo and Muhammadu Buhari served for multiple periods. This is a list of each president in the order of term length. First, Or Seguni Obasanjo, Military and People's Democratic Party. Longest continuous term, eight years. Term, total time in office, eleven years and 230 days period 2 cause of the end of the term resignation and the natural expiration 2 muhammadu buhari military and or progressive congress served 8 years and in total in office 9 years and 166 days period 2 deposed first and in natural expression will occur in 2023 number 3 yakub goen military longest continuous terms 8 years 362 days once in the office and was deposed fourth ibrahim babangida military served 7 years 364 days one season and was resigned six is good luck a very jonathan people's democratic party five years and 24 days one period natural expression number 6 sani abacha military served the four years 203 days one term cause of the end of the term death seven is shehu shagari national party of nigeria four years and 91 days one period deposed that's the cause of the end of the term number 8 umaru musa radwa people's democratic party 2 years 341 days one term cause of the end of the term death number 9 namud azikiwe national council of nigeria and cameroons served 2 years 107 days one period and was deposed Ten, Abu Abu Salam Abu Bakar military served 354 days one term cause of the end of the term resignation. Eleven, Mutara Muhammad military served 199 days one term cause of the end of the term assassination. Twelve, Johnson Awia Ilonson military. Served 194 days, one term, cause of the end of the term, assassinated, and the last, shortest, Ernest Shonekan, independent, served 83 days, one term, and he was deposed. The residents, the president of Nigeria, lives and works in Asolok Presidential Villa.
Thank you very much for being is, with us. Today we have focused about the list of all presidents of Federal Republic of Nigeria.